Dorchester, Massachusetts, USA, in 1852, at Meeting House Quarry, workers were using dynamite to break up the bedrock, when an explosion threw an artifact into the light of day, after spending many thousands of years under the earth. According to geologists, the Roxbury Rock, in which this mysterious artifact was embedded, has been dated as having accumulated between 570 and 593 million years ago, during the Eddie Cannon period. Imagine their surprise, when workers spotted a metallic object amongst the debris of the explosion, still partially embedded in a chunk of rock, and now sheared into two pieces from the forces of the blast. A zinc vase covered in flower decorations painted in solid silver. The bell-shaped pot is around four and a half inches tall and about six and a half inches long, and was noted as being exquisitely made. The age of the vase has been heavily debated amongst specialists, with many struggling to produce ages smaller than 100,000 years. Additionally, the species of flowers and plants that are illustrated upon the vase, also went extinct over 100,000 years ago. Not surprisingly, but rather predictably, the pot along with all authenticated documentation regarding its discovery, mysteriously vanished without trace shortly before a full investigation into its amazing history could take place. The initial discovery was covered on June 5, 1852, from the publication of the magazine Scientific American, which confirms its authenticity, as indeed being found embedded in the solid ancient stone, 15 feet below the surface. But shortly after this coverage, like so many other amazing objects found around the world vanished without trace. Who made this amazing artifact, when was it made? If we go by the age of the rock in which it was discovered, it is amazingly over 500 million years old, but we may never know.